Welcome back to your Feel Good Breakfast Show. It's so good to have you. And if you've just joined, you came at the perfect time because joining us are acclaimed musicians, Jimmy Nevis, as well as Craig Lucas. Perhaps you've heard of them. I don't know. Small, small people. I'm joking. One of the biggest superstars we have in South Africa and the Mother City. Now, they have joined forces for the very first time to create a powerful new single. Now, it is called Never Forget, and it's going to be released tomorrow. So we get some exclusive business going on here. And it's all to honor the legendary Bioscope in Weinberg of course, called the Lakshirama. We've got to give them a feel-good welcome. <laughs> <Woo -hoo! laughs> Honestly, I'm fangirling just a little bit now because I love the both of you. I play your music all the time on yeah. my show. Uh, Jimmy, we've spoken before on my show as well. So of to course. have you guys here coming together for a moment like this feels so significant. Can you tell me a bit more about this collaboration? Yeah. Well, I mean, first of all, it's good to be here. Myself, Craig, and your fur. Thank you um, for acknowledging her. <laughs> <laughs> but um, yeah, you know, I think Craig and I, we've been friends for many years. Um, I was actually there when he won The Voice. Yeah. And so I feel like I've seen his career like just over s such a vast amount of time. Um, and even though we've sung live together, we haven't actually been in studio together. So this is the first time that we've done something like this. Sure. And um, additionally, when I, I wrote the song, I actually was imitating his voice. <laughs> it was like, a, a, whoa. Imitators put it nice. <laughs> yeah, so I was, and I, I, you know, for me it was like, it's, it, I think it's time that uh, if anyone can give a ballad yeah. um, its, it's success, it's going to be Craig Lucas. Absolutely. So um, I'm, I'm super excited about this release. The song's coming out tomorrow. Yeah. Um, and it's also for a good cause. It's for the uh, the documentary called The Cape Town Song, mm. which is about the Lakshirama in Weinberg. And we need to talk about the Lakshirama in Weinberg because I think many people, perhaps the generation above us and beyond, were quite heartbroken to see that it is no more because yeah. they've got so many beautiful memories. I mean, I was having a conversation with my mom yesterday and she was like, yes, growing up, we couldn't even go to like the three arts, for example, because yeah. of the color of our skin. So yeah. the Lakshirama was the place to be. So to honor this in a beautiful documentary, documentary yeah. is stunning so tell me more about that so i mean the guys at mad little badger they were the ones who were heading up this documentary um and then i joined the project and for me you know yes of course the building is important but i think the memories and the mm. history is really what we're all about um i think that the documentary is a story about music yeah. it's about culture it's about community it's about weinberg um and for me I find myself going deeper and deeper into my roots, mm -hmm. the older I get, which is, it's wild. Um, but it just shows you that there's so much for us to learn. Yeah. There's so much education that still needs to happen. And I think just about like forgotten history. I mm -hmm. think there's a lot of things, um, you know, we forget that we are such a young democracy. Yeah. I mean, today we celebrate Mad Madiba Day. Um, and I think it's just important that we always pay tribute to those who have come before us, Absolutely. the legacies of so many musicians who have paved the way. Um, it just feels really fitting that we are the ones to tell that yeah. story. Yes, yeah. I would agree with that. I mean, Craig, maybe I can come to you. What does this song mean to you and this project that you're involved in? I mean, it's really special, you know, and I've been wanting to work with, with Jimmy for a long time. So when he reached out, I, I jumped at it. And, you know, I think the power of a good song is that it's relatable across the board. And for me, even just past the Lakshrama, you know, it's a song about loss and a song about remembering people that we've lost. And that's significant to me. Um, so yeah, it's just, it's just special all around. Um. Absolutely. And thank you for being in this vulnerable moment and leaning into it because I think, yes, that's exactly it. It's about grief, it's about loss, but also it's about celebration yeah. of what was, right? 100%. Now, speaking yeah. about celebration, like we mentioned, this documentary is being created. Yeah. But of course, anytime we're creating a project, money needs to be pumped into it. 100%. How yeah. do people actually <laughs> support this? Because it is a story that needs to be told. So, you know, we, we need people to be involved with this. Um, it's being made in the real time. Uh, we are sending updates. You can check us out uh, at A Cape Town Song on all social media, but especially Instagram. Um, and if you go check out acapetownsong.com, uh, you can find out more details of how to join the crowdfunding 
uh, project that we have going on so we can turn this documentary into a reality. Yes, please, let's. Because I think that there's something about archiving memories as well that people oh, for years to come can look back at. And there's so much of our history, I speak of my community, mm. that has just been swept under the rug. Yeah. And I think that it's important that we, we use these official spaces mm. to share uh, facts yeah. and memories about uh, our parents Absolutely. and about our parents' parents and our heritage yeah. and our legacy. Yeah, we're saying no yeah. to erasure. Okay, <laughs> we are here and we've been here. Yeah. Beautiful. Please tell me we can expect uh, an album with the two of you guys yes, together. So you know, Come you, on. You, Come you, on. <laughs> you give us a pinky, we take the whole body. The Not whole mind the thing, head. Man, Please you know, tell us there's more. Listen, um, all I can say is, I mean, there could be a remix. Uh, possibly <laughs> a yeah, I think yeah, that's come out. Right? No, I'm yeah. just joking. But um, for now, it's this song, yeah. and um, it's a very special song. And we're going to perform it here today. So. Oh, so what can we expect yeah. from the song? <sighs> Big harmonies. Ooh. Yeah. Hopefully, both of us singing in tune. <laughs> <laughs> I love that. Um, oh. And yeah, you know, like Craig said, it's a song also about loss. So for me, I think. It's, it's relatable, you know. Yes, yeah. it's inspired by the Lakshadama and the project, but it's it's there for anyone who's experienced any loss in any ways. Absolutely. Is this an exclusive? We just have to get that straight. This is the first... Yeah, first yeah this is an exclusive. Yeah. Yeah. If you're looking for exclusives, Espresso is where you got to be. It's your yeah. feel-good morning show for a reason. Guys, thank you so much. Thank and I'm you. so excited <laughs> to you. hear the song. Yeah. Jimmy Nevis and Craig Lucas. It doesn't get any better than this, does it, G? <laughs>